My name is Alan Prim. We're in, we're in Hampton, Arkansas, Calhoun County. I've owned this piece of land since 1977. My, my people were farmers, but they're also in a grocery store, and that's where I was raised primarily. I went to school here at Hampton and attended college in Arkadelphia and over in Monticello. And then I actually went to the oil field and I worked there in the oil well drilling business to the, in the 90s when, we, when I retired and came home to live on this farm. This farm had been in my family through some of my cousins and myself since back in the early 40s. My grandfather was a cotton farmer and he was, he was he was, my great-grandfather was a cotton farmer and he was down here on, Ro, on Ro, what we call Roark's Landing down on the side of the river, which is about five or six miles from here. So my family's been in this area for a long, long time. We made a decision that we wanted to come back here and raise cattle and be on this farm. And we talked about the things that we could do to make a living on the farm. We made a decision that we would have cattle, hay, and timber, and use those three things to make a living on the farm. And we did do that, and we did have been successful with it. We've just now, in the last few years, started harvesting timber that we've got and getting ready to replant it again for the next generation. But a couple of three or four years ago, I clear cut a track of land and we found gravel on it. And so I'm now digging gravel on that land and it's to be reclaimed when they're finished. And then we're gonna put it back in timber, but we're gonna move, remove the gravel too. So now we've got hay, we've got uh, cattle, we've got timber, and we've been using gravel also to make the farm work. I've got a mixed herd of cattle and they're grade cattle. There are not any registered cattle on there, but I use, I use, I use good bulls and I have good calves and that's all we have is a cow-calf operation. And I've always thought that if you had a way, I've got a gate on all of my head gates behind my cattle. In other words, they come through a gate and the gate closes and then they're into the head gate to hold them to be worked. I've always thought if you had a handle where you could close the gate from the back instead of coming to the front to close it, how much better that would be when you're pulling, putting cattle through. And so I built one, I couldn't find one, so I built one of my own. And it, it, for a one, op, one person operation, which I do, mo I work most of the cattle myself, unless Barbara helps me. That is a, that's quite an improvement over what I've done in the past, is having the handle on, the, the open and close handle on the gate in the back and in the front. So I can be six, eight feet behind the cattle and I can close the gate behind them. You know, it's been wonderful. Uh, I was born in the country and grew up in the country um, and was away from it for a while. But when we uh, decided to, to build here in this area or remain in this area where Alan already was, uh, it was like going home again. Something that we hope to pass the love on and the appreciation of the land and the amount of work that's gone into bringing it to the point where it is today. Uh, hope that we're making it something that can be sustainable in some way. We've tried to uh, go with the flow as time has changed our lives and uh, the farm itself, so it's a work in progress. I truly love what I do and, and I want to just keep right on and as long as I can I want to work my cattle and raise my cattle and put up my hay and harvest my timber and replant it and just keep that going. But it needs to be fun to you. If it's not fun to you, you shouldn't do it because you won't be successful. And if you don't want to work, it, it won't work either. I mean, it won't, it won't be successful. You need to like to work and love to work and be happy on the farm, to be happy on the farm. Because there is always, any place you stop on the farm, you can see 30 days of work if you have time to do it.